Hello YouTube, welcome. It's uh, 3DS Nintendo here, bringing you in another video of my 3DS games and etc. and reviews. Uh, you can notice I don't have my case with me because I left it in my room, and my room is too far away for me to run back and go get it because I am kind of lazy. Anyway, still got a Mario game here in my box. Like I will have every video. And I also have a new game to add to the collection. Remember how I got a Nintendo Dogs and Cats box? I have the exact game to go with it, too. I've already started the game and, and everything, and I got all the talking part done because it takes a while because you have to do it exactly the same way every single time. But anyways, I just got back from Walmart around uh, mm, eight, 8 ish or so. Yeah, about around 8. And I've got the game, Nintendo Dogs and cats and to the top and on the back it says bring home new furry friends it uses the street pass and you can take photos with your pets and then on the golden retriever version you can get a miniature dachshund a miniature pincher a miniature pincher a beagle a pug a golden retriever a shiba inu a great dane a maltese and an english cocker spaniel now i got a really good breed that i like on here at first I tried to get at first I tried the golden retriever but I didn't really like it so I started a new game. And I had gotten a good breed. This a really good breed. I guess I have to do that or something. I'll be trying to place this. Oops. Oh well, I'll just place it on the sides. You're not really gonna need to see it anyways. So anyways, I've got a really good breed and I'm on a walk with them right now. And Yep, I had gotten a Great Dane, a spotted Great Dane named Spot. And I'm on a walk, and we were just at the park, and I bought him a really nice little hat and a woven collar. And now, about this game, it's really fun to play, and the 3D is excellent. I know you can't see that, but it's really good. And uh, in these little patches that you find when you're on walks, you can find presents. Like, I'd already find two, found two presents, and it's really fun to go on walks, and you can go on walks all the time. You can give them little treats. Yes, no clue why, but sometimes a little exclamation point comes above his head. And you can get presents, like this one. See? I got the balloons. On the bottom, shooting at the balloons. And then, when you're walking, it's like... Uh, see that, but it's just like a dog with a leash and like a blurred out tan thing. And I haven't really gotten used to how you walk the dogs in this game. I kind of wish you could plan out your path and then change it whenever you want, but you can't, so. He has to go and stop at every single one, so let's keep going on. And that's our house straight ahead of us. Okay, come on. Go. Okay. Let's go. Okay, and then when you get home, this message will pop up. It says, You return home. It looks like Spot really enjoyed his walk. And it'll have your dog's name highlighted in blue. So you do that. And you come home. And now you have a whole bunch of supplies down here. You have your dog food, your dog water, your brush, your shampoo, your tennis ball, your biscuits, your frisbee, your boomerang, your balloons, your leather shoe, your AR camera. The, like you can pick up all this stuff. I bought this, 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 and I bought these and the treats. But I found the other shoe, the wood, the rubber, the leather, and I think that's about it that I found. And another shampoo thing. Anyways, what you can also do is you can go, you can walk all the time, whenever you want. Like I can go on another walk. But I'm going to show you the kennel. When you go back the second time, you'll be able to get cats. Yes? You have the standard 
the oriental, and the long hair. I like the standard ones, and the coats that you can get on it is solid, tabby, spotted tabby, and calico. My favorite is the calico, because my neighbor had a really pretty calico cat, and I, I really liked it. And I like, if I could get this one, I'd get this one. Yes, she's a cute little kitty. I want to see how much they are. Uh, oh wow, I might be. I can get them pretty soon. He's eight hundred and eighty dollars, or she is. And uh, you can also get Oriental. They come in pointed and smoke. Let's see what smoke is. And that's smoke. I don't really like the Oriental cats that much. And this is pointed. It's a pointed, it's like the regular kind of those. And then you have the long-haired cats, which also come in pointed and smoked. And that's the smoked version. I like that one the best. But I don't really want to get a long-haired tabby. So they remind me of Persians, and I'm not a big fan of Persians. Anyways, and then you can get the pointed, which looks like a Persian. See? So my favorite is the standard also known as a tabby most of the time. So we've got the calico again. And we've got the spotted tabby. It's kind of like a lion or something. Here, I can get a close-up on this gray one. There's a gray one. It's blue eyes. It's sneezing. And see, it's got spots on him. You can see that. Yes, yes you're a pretty little kitty. Okay, and then you can also get the tabby, which I think everyone should know what a tabby looks like, but if not, I'll get a close-up on this gray one. Yes. Okay, so you see it's striped. Instead of spotted, he's striped on both sides. And then you have the solid. Now they all come in, like the patterns also come in different colors. Like you got this gold one, and then you have that gray one that you just saw in the background, and then another gray one. My favorite out of these has to be the gold one, but I'm still going to probably either get a calico or a tabby. So, yeah, you can make friends with the cat and stuff. You can also get another dog. Like I got the Great Dane, which also comes in mantle, um, mantle, which is that Harquin, Harlequin, which is like the spotted, and then fawn, which is like this. And I'll show you the mantle. That's the mantle. See, it's like the regular one. And then you can get the cocker spaniel, which comes in party color or party color which is like the spots kind of like that yeah, I can get close up on one of them I'll get a close up on you because I like you you just friend him you befriend him okay there we go see he has like the spots on him and I like the spotted tail Go back and um get red. <sighs> Hold on one second. Never mind, I'm back. And that's the red. You don't really need a close up of them. Then you have the Maltese, which is all they're always gonna be white. Sometimes you'll get a multicolor well one with a colored face like this, but I, I think that's kind of rare. And then you also have your dachshund. It's comes in the regular red, which is just that. And then the black and tan, which is like the black body and the tan. They're all going to be the same like that. And then you have the Shiba Inu, which come in the red like that. And then with, sometimes you'll get one with black. It's in the back. He's, oh, fell. Sometimes you'll get ones like him that have a... Uh, Oh, uh, jeez. Okay, it has like a black tail and a black nose. And then, oh, we got the black and tan, which is just the same as that, but in black. 
And then you have the pug. She comes in silver fawn, black, and apricot fawn. So you got this. And then you have the all black. And then you have the apricot fawn. My friend, my friend, who's also my neighbor, actually has a black one. So that's pretty cool. And then you have the tricolored beagle. And the lime and white, which is like the tan and white almost. And then you also have your pinchers, which come in black and tan which is this, and then red, which is just all the red color. And then you also have the main one, the golden retriever, which only comes in obviously gold. But sometimes you get a lighter gold, or you get a like a darker gold like that, with like little spots on them. So I got the one that I like the most, and then I'm going to get the uh, tabby. And uh, another thing about this game is you can go shopping and you can go to get supplies, accessories, inter interior uh, or the pet hotel or that. You can go to the second hand shop to sell the stuff that you find, which I like to do. And there's a new thing that you can do to exchange materials and you can exchange it for like all this other kind of stuff. I'm saving up to exchange for that, to exchange for that, and I got already got one of two rubbers, and I have to get two metals, and two plastic, and you can get a fishbowl and a keyboard and all other kind of stuff, or you can sell your items, which is what I'm going to be doing right now. I'm going to sell the rubber leather shoe, the balloons. Cause my dog doesn't like them. Oops, sorry, can't rip it off. And that's about it. And now another thing that they kept was competitions, like disc competition and obedience. But they added another one in, which is oopsie, the luring course, the lure course. Let's see, I can't do any more because I already did two. But anyways, so they did that, which I thought was really cool. And you can go on a walk again, like see, you can go on another walk. But that will be all for my video. I will let you know when I get my cat. Peace out.